is in a good place, but the people who are indirectly associated with Tiger the dog aren't in a good place at all. Neighbor Jill Forsyth had called the SPCA to alert them to her concerns about Tiger's well-being because the dog was living outside in temperatures that felt like minus 40 degrees. When our viewers heard that the Hamilton Burlington SPCA could not step in and rescue the dog, they became outraged. I wish the laws were different so that it gave me the, the ability to do something differently. The SPCA was ripped apart online for not stepping in and taking Tiger, whose living conditions did not meet requirements for an outdoor dog. We do not have the ability just to walk on someone's property and remove that animal whatsoever. There has to be immediate distress or imminent danger for that animal. But the lack of action prompted someone to dog nap Tiger. Hamilton police say that is theft. The owner, whose first name is Milton, says he's upset someone stole his dog and that Tiger was perfectly happy with his living conditions. The dog's got a really good shelter. I don't know what's going on. I don't know who took my dog. I want my dog back. Honestly, I, got, I want my dog back. I'm going to go. I'm going to find out where my dog is because this is my pet. Nobody has the right to come in and take my dog from me. Milton was renting space from the president of Provincial Concrete Forming where Tiger was chained and guarding the rented land. Tony Silva was in the process of trying to evict him. He says the public is wrongly blaming him for leaving the dog in the cold when it's not even his dog, just a dog staying on his property. I'm not happy with all the emails and the harassment phone calls that I've gotten. Like two of them, there people are trying to shut down my business. I've worked very hard and I have done nothing wrong. Now what is wrong is the theft of a dog. The last time I spoke with Hamilton police, they wouldn't comment on Tiger's case, and that's mostly because Milton, the owner of Tiger, has not reported the dog stolen yet. Now hundreds of comments on the Only in Hamilton Facebook page support someone stealing the dog because supporters say Tiger's now been saved. And many are advocating for the laws to be stronger so the SPCA can step in and take an animal inside when it's left out in the cold. That's it for now, Nick. Back to you. Okay, thank you.